So Dylan apparently found the bucket he has to shit in. Yep. Can I kick it? Nope, it's locked in the background. Why would you kick the bucket? But um, da 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 da. Get drunk. That's why he's hallucinating. He drank whatever was in that bottle. Believe me, it wasn't wine. No. It was bleach. Exit. Absence. Abyss. Absence. Or whatever that's called. What an exit. Ecstasy. Absence. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I thought you guys were talking about ecstasy. No, no, no. Absence no. is not something you want to drink. I still don't want to say that's not right. I still don't want to say that's not what it's called. Absence? Yeah, it's a drink that has, like, hallucinogenic in it. Like, a yeah. hallucinogenic. Uh, it's something drink. like that. I can't remember. From, like, shrooms. But it's, oh, it's But it's, but it's uh, alcohol. It's actually illegal. Oh, yeah, it is legal. No, it's legal. Oh. Yeah, it, it is legal. Huh. <laughs> well, they probably sell it at the pub. Another visitor. It's insanely hard to get here. Our gentleman. I think you have to like import it. Yep. <clears throat> oh god, here we go. It's from the thing. Uh, from the magazine, someone found him. It's actually completely different people. Like the rat's the one that said magazine, or no, she's the one that said magazine. The rat said from someone phoned him, and then the other bitch is the one who said occult nonsense. Oh. Yeah. So this is a mess here. You speak lucidly for figments of my imagination. Nice special effects, too. If you can't tell, I work for a paranormal thing, <laughs> but I am a complete bigot. Yeah, no! This is all real! We demand cheese! We're here to help you determine your recalls! Oh, yeah. When Dylan brought up the cheese thing, my mom came in and tried to hand him a block of cheese. <laughs> Go to the netherworld and seek the dead. Your you gotta wait to the door. Ah! It's absent. Thank Absinthe, you. yes. Okay. It's a 19th century hallucinogenic drink made up of wormwood and impure alcohol. Who you do not want to drink And poisonous wormwood. coloring matter, like copper or salts. It's no longer like that. Uh, no. Because I think it's still made over, like, in Amsterdam and, like, Europe over there. Belge, uh, the invisible is waiting for you. All oh, right, he's got, like, a fucking, an invisible man in a cloak as an ally. Huh. I forgot about him. He'll let you into the netherworld, you fat fuck. Yeah. Hee <laughs> hee, not exactly a cool one, are you now? Ah! Jesus. My name is Frizzy, cry up for the dead. Ah! Such a sad thing. Someone else from the village Yeah, how does it feel? Died. What shall come from this? Miss the loudest person on this stream, and now you're getting a dose of your own medicine. I don't know why I said string. I can't breathe through my nose. Now when she said cry over the dead, you should have, like, balled your eyes out. <laughs> on top of the hill in the village is the hinge that was created by the ancients. The stone. Somehow, once a year, on some high night, the bat that goes go, 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 beneath the hinge opens up. If you eat the red cheese, or if you eat the blue cheese, you'll wake up back in your house and nothing happened. If you eat the red cheese, I'll show you happy land. I can't even remember how it goes. I noticed the Morpheus glasses. That's why I did that. <laughs> By the human cal cal calendar that occurs on November 2nd, today. you never seen The Matrix. I've heard lots of jokes about it, but I've never seen the movies. Uh -huh. He's the black guy with the glasses. Mm, I've seen memes. <laughs> <clears throat> Hold on. I say he was you. I know his was real tricky. I wanted him to be like a little bit different than everyone else. Is it? I already forgot it. Oh, hello. My, my name is Jimmy Squarefoot. I know, I know that's wrong, but whatever. D don't believe you can meet the dead, d do you? Well, just have a look outside. You, you won't believe what's going going on out there. Hubba bubba bubba bub, hubba bubble. I know that's wrong. I already forgot it. But it whatever. doesn't matter. You'll find out when you watch the recording. <sighs> nah, not even gonna bother. Fuck him. <laughs> he's like, go to hell. Damn, he's creepy. Uh huh. <laughs> he's actually really important, is the sad part, but not for this. Here you come, Dylan. You gotta voice all these people now. Nope, not me. <gasps> Ooh. Oh, oh. Mm. Good evening. Headline, Mr. My apologies, revealed. but do oblige me by following my lead. I was, he actually has a voice, too. I can't even remember how his goes. Well, oh, that's you. You'll suck Phantom of the Opera. Even invisible men need to express themselves. I can't even get dialogue off. <laughs> was the afternoon mystery solved? No, and I'm without a clue. 
May I suggest an interview with the deceased? I am Bilal. It's Belgay. Belgay. And I can entrust you on making contact. Instruct. Could be Belgian. I'm like trying to move from the yeah, mic. Spiritualism died 100 <laughs> years ago. We can't put rubbish without channeling and seances. <laughs> Chuckle. Ah, but I sense that you are a man of deep curiosity. Much as deep as the invisible under my hood. Accompany me to the South Hinge, where we shall try an experiment. You should be most pleased by the results. Alright then, fuck it. God damn it. Keep following the road south until you reach the Hinge. It's an ancient relic created by the forebearers of this land that grants wishes. Yes. Wishes. Alright then. So, Ellen has a scarecrow, and you have a invisible phantom of the opera. Yep. <laughs> and you thought this was going to be a normal game. <laughs> uh, I, I knew it wasn't. I was kind of just talking to whoever happened to be watching this, thinking it was normal. Whoever that may be. Probably a good fat nobody. <laughs> good fat nobody. Sarah's going to love this, since you guys are voicing it. Right? We've been expecting you. This way, please. May I take your hat? The Oval what? Hinge, a mysterious megalith monument created by the ancients. He's kind of a dick. What does this all have to do with meeting the dead? I agree. Yeah, no, he's a complete asshole. I've no time But he's the most skeptical now, person sir. here, so I can't really blame Pranks. him. We must catch up with her. <laughs> hey, who? You'll find out when you go into the fucking thing that I keep telling you to do, you asshole. Hmm. Ah, right, then fuck it. Fucking four eyes prick. <laughs> You're one to talk, you masked vigilante douchebag. Well, you know, like they just start getting in a huge argument. I think they do later, actually. Like, they get into a fucking, like, something weird. Either that or he starts liking him. There's someone down there. I can hear them talking. It's the girl from the cliff, sir. Oh, yeah, he's a lot like kind of a butler to him in a sense. That's why I was going she for She believes it. the legend that you can meet the dead. Those legends are not just the delusions of the ancients. <laughs> They're about as far fetched as me. Look at me, goddamn. They it. are truths that they have bequeathed, bequeathed to us. Tonight, that girl becomes the long awaited messenger between the real world and netherworld. See how everything's starting to add up now, you dumb. F <laughs> the netherworld. You mean the land of the dead? Well, this should make the front page if it's not full of shit. Okay, you sarcastic asshole. So, invisible gentleman, I suppose you brought me here so that I can win my Pulitzer. Okay, you sarcastic dickhole. What if, what if you too could acquire that power? All I want is a good story. Oh, trust me, you'll get one. And one cannot survive in the netherworld without gaining a certain power. Prick. Hmm. Yeah. For a story like this, I'll do whatever it takes. Are you actually uh, starting to believe me now? Fuck it. The girl the will obtain a cloak in order to pass through the netherworld. The stench of the netherworld is similar to a dog. <laughs> Jesus. All you need to do is be near her when she does. I can't smell anything. And you'll get one hell of a rush. When a new messenger is chosen, guardians are also chosen. That is certain to be you. <laughs> Whoever the fuck just coughed in the background in the netherworld needs to shut the fuck up. Achoo! It's just a dead guy <laughs> with a sick. <laughs> I'm British. Looks like she's getting getting some uh, good old hentai going on <laughs> with her cloak. Uh, I don't say how close I was actually to... Substantial. Oh, he's technically invisible. Yeah. Rips his freaking shirt off. This is actually cool as hell. So she's a messenger, and now he's a guardian. Yep. Okay. Nice task, bro.
Yeah, he's like, oh, this is definitely making the front page. Yeah, like she became, she becomes like a watchdog, and he basically becomes God himself. It's crazy. You think after like the power transformation, he, he wouldn't would need, need glasses? Yeah. He doesn't actually. He don't wear them in that form. Splendiferous. <laughs> Y okay. Hey, I think I did decent. Take her from this place so that she bring us to the other world. And bring her back so I can see her at the strip club. I will pay her a fine dime. This cane ain't just for show, you know. I kind of wish you'd gave him like a pimp voice. <laughs> we might have to change some things. Well, I just saw like how he was dressed and everything, yeah. and like how like fancy, and like how he was talking. So I was like, I kind of see like a oh yeah, no, he's a ghost pimp, like a butler esque type deal. He's a bit, be he's a bit between a ghost butler and a ghost pimp. 18th century ghost pimp. <laughs> I'll see what I can do. Y'all yeah, bitches. <sighs> What's the time? Mm. You can step through the portal. Yeah. What are you doing talking to me? Get that form which you momentarily took is known as a transession. Transcension. Transcension. A transcension. That would imply that something was A transition there. between Sleepy. not becoming a pimp and definitely not becoming me. Indeed, a slumbering power deep inside your soul, shall we say. You have received the power to do battle in the netherworld. Now through the door, you shall meet the dead one you seek. Didn't know I was looking for a dead one. Alright then, let's go. Onward! To victory! Well, they seem to be like, Argh, Jesus Christ. <coughs> they seem to be like, oh, you're looking for this person. I am. <laughs> this looks a bit like the door to Cthulhu's lair. Hello, Shane. Do you really just say who's Cthulhu? Next time while we beat her to death. <laughs> <laughs>